What's up, peoples? It's Super the Comic. Ace Dragon unboxing featuring Nam. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud, man. Anyway, uh, go to link the, his, his channel into the description. Spicy channel when he up actually uploads content. He hasn't uploaded in like months. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in months because my front camera doesn't work. Oh yeah, and then you deleted 2,000 memes and your, and your camera still didn't work. Rest in peace to those 2,000 plus memes. <laughs> they will be missed. <laughs> you can't even use a small price to pay for salvation meme in that case. I didn't even attain salvation. Exactly. Anyway, yeah, so first of all, the um the first uh, front of the box, you have Ace Dragon. Comes with the... um. Light Launcher and Dragon Winder. Kind of reminds me of the Dragon Winder that we had from Metal Fight. Ace Dragon Sting Charge. Dragon Winder is uh, by far the best part of the entire thing. Like, you don't even need the bases. Ace, wait. You just need the Dragon Winder. What, the, the Blade Blade? <laughs> but yeah, left side of the box, uh, Grand Dragon. Uh, so they, the thing is with the Gachinko, um system, you it's um, interchangeable. You can um, change different layer bases and layer weights. But not Diabolos. Lord Diabolos is literally is physically impossible. But yeah, for this it's um uh the B one B one thirty three Deluxe Starter uh, Ace Dragon Sting Charge Zan. Is it gonna uh, yeah? It comes with a launcher, um two layer bases and yeah. Left side of the box. Oh yeah, chew, chew that, chew that. But yeah, um first left side of the box it just shows how you put it together a Gachinko Beyblade. And the right side of the box, it just shows the um this parts, the layer itself, which is um Ace Dragon Zan, Dre um Grand and Rock is um two extra bases, and the disc is Sting Driver Charge, and the um the LR Launcher. Are um the are some of the parts in the game, which um if I remember correctly, which I think I do, and this is a stamina based meta, this or at least Sting. Is gonna help out a lot with stamina. Meanwhile, charge being an attack driver, as much as it would help, Octa would probably be a better uh, suit. But Octa's not even that go good though. Yeah, but Octa's not even that yeah, good Octa. though. I mean, in that case, just wait for the um, Red Bahamut, uh triple, or the triple booster set that's coming out. That comes with Orbit Metal. Orbit Metal is one. Of, if if they actually allow that in Burst Classic, it's going to be um like um, Burst Classic's Atomic. Either way, back of the box, uh, Ace Dragon, uh, Ace Dragon Zan, uh, so you have the Gachinko Chip, it's like all over the place. The Gachinko Chip, Dragon, weight, Layer Weight Zan, the, um, the Layer Base is Ace, Disc is Sting, and then the Driver is Tards. So you, no, so you go from the Layer Base, Ace, to Gachinko Chip, Dragon, Disc, um, Disc, uh, Driver, then Layer Weight. It's all over the freaking box. Anyway, um, the stats for Ace, Grand, and Rock Dragon. I wouldn't really trust these. It just depends on mold and stuff. Grand and Rock. Um, extra long ripcord. It comes with the LR launcher too. Code for this. Um, extra long. <laughs> extra strong. But yeah, without, uh, but yeah. Attack type, uh, right spin, burst system, GT layer system. You no, know, the thing is, the fact, and even um, is, even if the interchangeable layers or um, the interchangeable bases is grand or grand and um, rock, they're still all an attack type because of the parts. So like, it doesn't, that just it doesn't really make sense to me. Well, so it was mainly just to incorporate the fact that like, hey, um, even with the attack type parts, we do still have layer bases for a stamina and a defense. Yet yeah, drum uses those in the anime. Yeah, yet yeah, drum uses the um, uh, grand and oh, oh drum, huh? Uh -huh. No, no, we're not starting this. We're not starting this. <laughs> no, the translator of Maji is drum. If the translator for Maji can or can like mess up something like Rodin to Rodin, then we can then we can assume that drum is actually dream. Who names their child? After an instrument. <laughs> I mean, you're right about that, but still. I mean, honestly, I already knew that his name is Loden. Um, it just, I guess, kind of rolls off the tongue for me to say Roden and type Roden, as opposed to just saying Hajima Loden. But yeah, top of the box. Uh, I mean, at least they didn't name him Dante. <laughs> Dante Cory. Delta Zachro. Delta Zachro. 
anyway, um, chain, saying that you can interchange between Ace Grand Rock, um, Dram Koryu or Drum Koryu, whoever you want to say in Nam's case, Dram. But yeah, Butter Knife of Reflection. Reaching around my tripod. Let's let's open it from the left. Tape on the bottom too. Let's actually get to the unboxing now. Yeah, that's actually. I've been talking for five minutes about one box. And I love how I'm not using an exacto. I'm literally using a butter knife. Anyway. Using a butter knife comic. Yes. Yes. Hey, I, hey, I'm not home, and I would I would have used an exacto, but I'm not home. Closing it. You know what? Anyway, the box. Hey, opening it to the box, you got the rip cord. It's an extra long rip cord. It's literally the same length as the Phoenix Winder, but this um is a better buy because um it's LR. So you have the yeah, the LR is much stronger, and if I remember, it's more durable than the, uh, regular light launchers. Overall, it's better to... I would've bought Relight Phoenix and then just, like, bought some random, uh, light launcher L because the Phoenix Finder works on both. Oh, true that, true that. the announcement of the Dragon Winder for LR, I decided I was gonna hold out until Ace Dragon, uh, or till Ace Dragon was out, and that's what I did, and I bought it, and, uh, yeah, um, I have Ace Dragon. Smart lad. Smart lad. I have big brain 50 IQ. Wait, I th wait, wait, I thought you had 30 brain cells. I had 30 brain cells. I got raised another 20 brain cells. <laughs> oh my god. Remember, you, you let me consume one of your beans. Oh yes, the bean. Anyway, we have the Gachenko, um customized set. Uh, uh, let's see. Slash Dragon Retsu on Sting Evolution. Who the frick uses Evolution? Grand, Grand, um, Grand Ashura 10 on Hurricane Eternal? And Slash, is, wait, what is it with Retsu? Wait, never mind, that's Zan. I'm Stoops. Uh, Bujin Valkyrie. Dude, what's with 10 being released on, like, so many releases? I don't know. No, I thought, honestly, 10's been released so many times, but, like, Zan and 10 are the most released, um, uh, layer weights. Don't forget Sen as well, like... So, oh, Sen's so only released, like, being released a couple times, though. Like, Valkyrie and Ten, if releasing those two together is like the new 12 disc oh of my. the GT system. Oh my god. Anyway, yeah, Bujin, Valkyrie on Zan, double O bump keep. Bump. No, that double O proof. Wait. Yep, that's a red proof. Yeah, a red. The thing I mean, for the. Can't you also just look at the abbreviation? Mm, I could. But then again, I won't. Uh, stickers for the Ace Grand Rock layer base and driver and stuff. Yeah, into the box itself. Our report already viewed that. And you have the box. And you have so much freaking stuff in here. Launcher. Ah! Oh, ye, uh, let me just one of my layer grips right now. Or, let, uh, launch your grips. I'm stupid. Ye, I'm back with my, um, launcher grip thing on the bottle. Thingy, right here. In the meantime, uh, they get to hear Nam scream, like, 12 JoJo openings. Huh, <laughs> uh, joke's on you, I already have my launcher grip. But, yeah, everything here, it comes with the launcher. I'm just gonna... It's a pretty beefy launcher, honestly. It's the same thing that released with Spring Requiem. You know, the one that looks similar and is almost exactly like... Oh, yeah, the, um... Yeah, the long LR. Yeah, they're released separately. Pretty sure that's the launcher that Hoei uses. Uh, wait, which one? The, um, the long LR... Yeah, the long LR, the, um, the white and purple one. Yeah, the white and purple one is the one that Hoei uses. I'm not sure how, but, like, I don't think a lot of people have noticed that a lot of the characters in the show either use, like, one of the launchers or, like, a grip accessory. Like, so Wakia, he used, um, the blue, uh, grips, or the blue rubber grips for his, uh, launcher. 
Oh yeah. Can we use um the white and purple um uh long LR launcher? Just side promotions. Um, side promotion that no uh, literally no one use, um notices. Laban used uh the blue LR string launcher. To that, to that. Wait, didn't Count Knight use the golden LR? Golden LR? Yeah, Count Knight used the golden LR. Either presumably because uh either presumably to switch the direction of any bay he wanted, or just because it was rare because it's literally a golden launcher. Probably both. But yeah, right. well yeah, Count Knight used the golden LR, or Count Knight fell for you half broke kids. <laughs> anyway, everything here: Ace Dragon Zan, the Grand Layer Base, Rock Layer Base, Sting, and Charge. Let's just get Charge out. This okay? This driver for one is beefy as frick. This this driver beefy as frick. No. No, nah, it's fine. It, just to make the video, just like spice it up a little bit. But yeah, this driver is actually very heavy for a driver. It's the second heaviest driver. I mean, bullet is the heaviest, but that's only with the um the the mini Beyblade on it, and that's pretty inconsistent. So eh. But yeah, the um LR, you just put the ripcord in. Go shoot. It's LR. You could also wait. Never mind. No, that's spring requiem, and you can't change the direction with this. That's tough. Uh, you could also, these two sides, you could put a, a launcher grip on here, so that's pretty cool. And, and just... Or, and you could put a baylogger up here for you. Uh, um, what does the, uh, what does the dragon winder look like for the, um, Spriggan Requiem Light Launcher? Did you say the dragon winder for the Spriggan Requiem Light Launcher? Yeah. Spriggan is not a dragon. No, I said the light launcher. Oh. The, oh. Er, er, the friggin' light launcher. That oh, the, the black and red. Oh, the launcher itself? With the dragon winder. Um... I didn't bring my um spring record launcher up here. I used the, um, I'm saying um, a couple of my launcher design for tournaments. I mean, not gonna lie, if uh, you had the Diablos launcher, I think you could actually make, like, a better color setup. True that, true that. Um, oh, I just noticed. Um, launcher um, customization is actually legal, so I could actually unscrew some of my launchers and customize them. Yeah, yeah that's, that's the thing that I was planning on doing one day, is like buying, I guess, two copies of a launcher. I'm going to start kind of modifying it to look like it. Like, take the um, Long Bay Launcher LR. I was planning on like buying uh, two of them, well, like two Chosy Achilles, so that I could get two of them, so we one unmodified and the other modified. Oh, and shoot. Two. Regular Bay Launcher LR again, and I'm going to keep unmodified the other two modified with. So now I'm just going to interchange all the red parts, so like all the red parts of the black parts on the regular ones. That way I have more of like an anime kind of uh, Bay Launcher LR. Oh, that's, a, that's actually pretty spicy. I'm the spicy boy. He's using 50 of his brain cells, people. And. In the meanwhile, I've struggled to get this plastic off. Now you see, uh, basically the Gachinko layer system is customizable, and everything is pretty much like Twin Nemesis. So yeah, the the, the driver charge. It's literally um, a cell but metal, and it's like a big really chunk driver. Then you have Sting, a disc that's actually pretty very, very a disc that's very good on atomic, and the spring. It's like spring loaded. That springs both ways, left and right. That's pretty tough. Huh, now if only we actually had parts that allowed you to use the gimmick of Sting. Tough. The uh, you have parts that allow you to use the gimmick of Sting. Freaking God Valkyrie on Sting Power. So first up, you have the. I'm so upset because like I love these theory discs so much, but they never, some of them never actually be able to be used for their gimmicks because no drivers are tall and short enough. You just have to have that one driver that's in the middle, though. Either way, you have yeah, to you get like either volcanic dash and then a very worn variable to be able to like maybe make it work. Tough. Anyway, you have the rock layer base. It's base. It's supposed to be the defensive layer base of the three, but it's uh, debatably the worst, if not the worst layer base out of all of them. Grand is probably the best. Speaking of grand, we have the grand layer base. It's kind of reminds me of Drasil. Wait, not Drasil. What's it called? Dronzer. Uh, Dronzer, uh, 
Spiral? Drawn's Spiral, I think, yeah. Yeah, Drawn's Spiral. The shape of it reminds me of Drawn's Spiral. And kind of, and kind of a um, Blaze Ragnarok, sort of. But I see Drawn's Spiral more. But yeah, all these are just like very, very light, around the same weight. Then you have Ace Ace on Zan, Ace Dragon Zan. Take uh, take the, the layer base, or take the this thing apart. So how you take it off, you take off the clips or uh, push in the clips. If you get uh, Slash Valkyrie, the first time assembling that thing, it's a nightmare. I couldn't even assemble it Oof. For, for like a solid minute. Well, now you have the layer base or everything taken off. The um, layer base by itself, just like white and just white, yellow and some blue accents. I actually like that. Either way, now you have the Dragon Gachinko chip. Pretty uh, all these all these things pretty much weigh the same, except with the exception of the Diablos. The teeth, the G yeah, the Gachinko chip is what um, holds the teeth together and how you launch it. Oh, this video is 15 minutes already. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's fine. <laughs> oh, I more editing for me, but uh, and I don't care. And I dropped the Gajigo chip. But yeah, uh, all these vary, and this is around... These are pretty average teeth for an attack type. Pretty pretty average teeth for an attack type. Then you have Xan. All these things only weigh about, like, 3 grams or something. Uh, um, like, remember, remember the time when attack actually was part of the meta? Oh my god. He, oof. Oh, that's a, that's, a, that's a diss. That's a diss right there. Anyway, now my Discord is going like sicko mode. Either way, so that's a um Ace one's Ace, Ace Dragon Zan. So. Kind of upset that the only uh, burst where attacks actually viable is burst classic. Yeah, V two knuckle quick dash is where it's at, bro. V two knuckle and literally almost any dash driver. Mm, good luck. Good luck beating that, and then you have Rock Dragon. Rock Dragon on Zan actually looks pretty spicy, not gonna lie. Get this off, please. Um, me personally, um, I think, or I used to think that the best looking layer base was Rock, but then I actually got, and then I thought the worst was like Grand, but then I actually got Dragon for myself, and I just decided, well, you know what, this actually doesn't look that bad, and it's now, like, one of my favorite looking, and I remember one of the best performing layer bases. Honestly, Grand Dragon, looking at it, it's okay, but the color scheme looks kind of, like, weird in my opinion. Yeah, that's what I thought. Like, it didn't match Dragon like I thought the other two did. Honestly, uh, my, my, I, I guess for, in terms of uh, the looks, Ace Dragon is more, is more so clean, and, and Rock Dragon looks just like better in general. I'm sad that Rock is one of the best looking layer bases, but it's the worst performing. True that, it's like one of the, like, the worst performing layer bases, period. And put, put this thing together. Grand uh, Rock Dragon. No, I'm just gonna keep Rock Dragon like that for the whole video, for the rest of the video at least. Oh yeah. Then it had those little two notches at the top of it. But yeah. Then we have the. I guess the rest of the parts. I'm gonna put it together and seal the teeth. And these teeth are pretty spicy. Yeah. They're I would provide commentary on, like, the locking. I forgot to bring my dragon with me. Tough. But, yeah, the locking is actually pretty decent. Um, I've heard... decent, but there are much better ones out there, at least as far as I'm concerned. Valkyrie actually probably has some of the worst uh, locking so far. Oh, yeah. By the way, um, in Discord yesterday, I pretty much um, used my, my big brain observation and literally, like... It destroyed Nam's hope for making. All hopes in me making a good Valkyrie combination. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going. I'm scrolling up on Discord right now. And oh yeah, we also had a big. We also had a big. I guess kind of quarrel about how a blitz. They can make. They should make like um. Takara should make like different. Made yeah differently made blitz discs. They should. But they didn't. <laughs> Either way. Do you want a three pointed blitz on your? Lord Spriggan? No, thank you, but still, you can't... <laughs> you can't take a three-pointed... No, you can't take... You can't completely, like... You can't change the shape of a disc and still call it Blitz, though. But, yeah. Get back... But, yeah, back to the topic about teeth. 
Um, Valkyrie, you can change your chip or teeth are ineffective because of how bulky they are. The fact that they're bulkier than normal teeth, the, um, the first two that you pass, all you can pretty much do is pray. One Valkyrie click is at least a click and a half. And the fact that in um, the last extremely bulky teeth, which are the, um, the last tooth set, it basically makes the go Beyblade go oof. But yeah, that's going to conclude the... I guess the Joker Pachinko chip is probably the best one out of them all so far. Maybe. But yeah, that'll be all for this. Like more teeth and it still has the bolt. Diablos. Diablos. Diablos literally has three teeth. But Diablos is left and right spinning, though. While maintaining the same um, locking. But yeah, that'll be all for this video. P really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. See you guys later. This video is 20 minutes and 30 seconds. Uh, peace out, comment out, God bless. <laughs>